Look what happened to this maid. Look at that. And now she wants to sue me, her boss. Well, here's the thing. Look, she was there washing her clothes. Look, people, look at the fact that she's totally there with nothing on, right? And the danger is right there. Look at that. And the socket is plugged in. And she's barefoot, people. And then you know what it's like, right? The worst can happen at any moment, and that's what happened in this video. Well, I think that at the very least she should have been wearing a pair of slippers so that this wouldn't happen. And what you're going to see now is precisely because of that, and because she was barefoot, that everything happened. Well, as I said, now she's trying to file a lawsuit against her boss, who owns the house. Do you think that's right? Well, she was there doing her job quietly, barefoot. I don't think she should be barefoot. Maybe she has a certain freedom to be barefoot in that house. And she put the clothes in there for us to wash. But, look, the moment she touched it, she felt a very strong discharge, and this happened to her. And honestly, I don't think the boss had anything to do with it. At the very least, she should have had her shoes on. She shouldn't have been in that situation so that this wouldn't have happened. I think that's the minimum, right? And then she goes over there calmly, very carefully, and closes the machine door again. She puts her hand in the machine. That's a brave woman, isn't she? Anyway, she puts things back in order. However, she took advantage of the fact that there was a security camera filming the whole situation in order to file a lawsuit. And then the video was leaked. I honestly think that this woman's action, this domestic worker's, is totally unnecessary. I think she's being very opportunistic with the whole thing and trying to get away with it. Look, look at this, people. And then she's right there. She sees that the situation is over, that she's pulling the plug because she doesn't know if she should keep messing with it. Guys, honestly, I think we should be very careful, cautious when we're messing with these things, you know? So here's a tip for you. Because the way this woman is doing all this is totally wrong. And now, when she's disconnected the wire, right? She takes all the clothes out of the machine. Then she, she calls her boss so she can see what's happened to the machine. But here's the thing. She's justifying it by saying that it's her boss's fault. Well, what do you think of this situation? Guys, it's the boss's fault. It's her fault. Leave your opinion here in the comments and share this video.